Chicken Coop Chronicles. Just saying good morning to the new mama with her 11 chicks. We haven't quite counted for sure. We did a visual count yesterday, so I think there's 11. Ben thinks there's 11. But here she is in the morning. Didn't get it on camera, but we had to round up a bunch of those truants because they all got out through this little cage that we've got here. They are small enough to get out of this hole. And so they did. And they were really worried. And now we finally got them back in there, the silly little things. But that's Missy. No, that's Minnie with her little brood. And I've got to get them some food and water today. I've got some chick starter for them. Well, good morning. Look at that proud mama. Yes, we're going to get you some food and water. Yes, you good mama. Hmm. All right, Chicken Coop Chronicles. Good morning. Setting up for the chicks now. So I have this tractor that I built. And it's called a tractor. Don't ask me why. But what it is, is it's a little portable cage. And I put it down here. I put some hay inside. I've got some chick feed there. Chick grower starter. I've got one hen who wants chicks there. And I've got one hen with a lot of chicks in there. And I've got some water right there. This screen closes up this big side. And then this side here opens. Like so. And I'm not taking them outside into the wild yet. Which is what I would normally do with the tractor. Is I would put it over a bunch of plants and let them go around and eat grass and stuff. But they're still too small. So... They're really young, and uh, we will, they will grow fast, and once they're big enough to not slip through chicken wire, that's when I'll take them outside. <laughs> Alright, next step is to put them in here one by one for an official count. And there they are, people. Eleven little chicks with Minnie, Mommy Minnie, in the tractor. In the chicken coop. <laughs> Eating breakfast. <coughs> Eleven little chicks with mommy Minnie in the chicken coop <coughs> having their first breakfast. I threw down some mealworms for them, kind of crushed them up a bit. They'll like that. And she's always on the lookout for any issues. We have here the mighty predator, Gracie, 
Yeah, she's a good girl too. She wants food. She's not really looking at the chicks for breakfast yet. She wants me to get her some wet food. She's a spoiled little kitten. Come, come. Come, come. Come, come. Okay, cool, cool. Yeah. See if I can figure out a bag. There we go. Oh yeah. So we'll do that. But just once. Can you make the sound and we'll do it? Some of them might peck from your hands if you hold your hand down. Autumn might. A snowball might. Autumn will. Autumn will. My hand. <laughs> Here you go, Autumn. Oh, Here you go. Here you go. Daisy. Daisy never does, does it usually. If you just sit down and put your hand out, hold your hand out. Come, come. Come, come. scared of me. That's cool. <laughs> it's funny when they get your finger too. Yeah, it doesn't hurt. No. Just a little surprising. It's not like an ostrich. <laughs> you would know. <laughs> don't actually. I met an ostrich once, but... I've seen him. I, uh, <laughs> not really the hugest fan. No, they're just chickens. They're just big chickens. I guess. <laughs> All right. There they are at the food tray, learning how to eat. That's the proud mama with her 11 babies. And there's the dad over there, Phantom. Oh, he's a loud fella. He's got no clue. He doesn't know what these, doesn't know what these things are. I don't even know if he knows what role he played in their formation. And that's Minnie. Oh, no, sorry, that's Missy right there. That's Missy. That's Phantom. And I suspect that Minnie, the mom, and Missy collaborated on building the clutch before Minnie sat. 
because it's really hard. They, they lay one egg a day. So for her to get 11 built up over a short enough time to be able to sit on them, I mean, they can lay the egg and come back to it tomorrow and, and it'll still be alive and dormant. So that way they can build up a nest. But I think they both built up the nest for a while because I was missing the banty eggs. And I think they're, those chicks are probably from both of the banty hens. Anyhow, you must be a proud father. Good phantom. He's a scaredy cat. And so are the chicks and so is Minnie. So these chicks are genetically predisposed to be scared of humans. But he is pretty gentle and his father was gentle before him. So should be all right. Chicken Coop Chronicles, never a dull day.